Tocantins, the place where our eyes and hearts shine with the same intensity, the place of astonishing landscapes, of lands in abundance, of natural resources, of the best animals, of sustainable tourism, of workforce, of joy, and the place of commitment with every one of those who has the same motivation. Turn the state a big producer of food for Brazil and also the world. In the center of Brazil, Tocantins is destined to occupy the strategic position of a great producer and worldwide exporter. Its position favors the distribution of goods and access to the main consumer gates of Brazil and the world. The growth of exports in just one year draws the attention. The evolution was of 26.14%. Tocantins has more than 277,000 square kilometers, an area bigger than England, Portugal and Belgium together. It shares borders with six states, Maranhão, Piauí, Bahia, Goiás, Mato Grosso and Pará. The backbone of Brazilian logistics crosses our lands. The multimodal transport logistics is strategic for those who produce and generate riches here. The North-South Railway crosses Tocantins and enables the access to Itaqui and Santos Harbors, flowing the production fastly and with a low cost to any direction. Nowadays, there are two large platforms that work in the cities of Palmeirante and Porto Nacional, besides another one that's already been planned in Gurupi. This structure makes the grain and ore production to be easily exported to several continents. More than 7,000 kilometers of state and federal roads are already paved. The state government is preparing paving projects for new roads. An example is the road TO500 that will bring a new flow of goods connecting Tocantins to the state of Mato Grosso. Palmas Airport, with the biggest area of the country, is due for the installation of companies that use this segment. Its cargo terminal is already in process of customization. The state has regular flights of passengers and cargoes provided by the main Brazilian flight companies, connecting Tocantins to southeast and west center of Brazil. With the new tax incentive that reduced the tax over aviation fuel, the companies have already started a new planning for new routes, including also the north and northeast of Brazil. The state is crossed by rivers that enable the full implementation of the Tocantins waterway, a mark in the transport logistics that will allow the integration between Tocantins and Amazonas basins, connecting by water the harbors of Belém and Manaus to Tocantins. Another important project is the Praia Norte Harbor that will facilitate even more the connection between Tocantins to the Atlantic Ocean and the main harbors around the world. It will work as a depot of the Manaus Free Zone in Tocantins. The development will allow bigger agility and economy, reducing the distance to the European, American and Asian markets. We are strong in agribusiness. The state is the last expanding viable agriculture frontier in the world. 8 million hectares of pasture, more than 5 million hectares yet to be explored. A herd of beef cattle of 8.7 million animals. The last six years, the grain production almost doubled. For the 2024-2025 crop, the projection is around 14.4 million tons of grains. In this time, there will be a growth of 2.1 million hectares in just five years. We have the second largest hydrographic basin of the country, with huge reservoirs that can get to 150,000 hectares of water blade, allowing the implantation of big aquaculture parks for fish farming. Tocantins water has a natural pH around 7.0 and the ideal temperature that favors the fast and uniform growth of fish during the whole year. 
with the permit for the creation of tilapias in fishnet tanks in Tocantins, new opportunities arise to the pisciculture productive chain enterprise. According to Macroplan Consulting, Palmas is the sixth best capital to live in Brazil. When it comes to health, Palmas ranks second place among the 100 biggest cities of Brazil. When we talk about education, Palmas ranks the fourth place. Tocantins offers excellent options of recreation, sports, culture, health and education. Everything with safety. With a lot of work and will, in one decade, Tocantins' GDP went above double. And it's because all of this that we are ready for the new phase of the world economy.